The Friday prayers usually draw large crowds. Today, it is near empty at the Islamic Association of North Texas, one of the largest mosques around. They immediately took action. They suspended all the activities. They made sure that the entire facility was uh, disinfected. Azhar Aziz is with the North Texas Imams Council, one of several groups coordinated to help mosques navigate through COVID-19 using guidelines. One member here at IENT tested positive, confirmed through the mosque's Facebook post. The mosque will shut down for two weeks. Several others now have two. My job is to keep educating and tell people, you know, what is this disease is about. Dr. Amr Shakil is with the Dallas Muslim Medical Alliance. Doctors, nurses, helping in an advisory capacity. Our mosques are very unique because we play in very close proximity. We stand next to each other. The few mosques that are open only allow 10 to 25% capacity. Closed bathrooms, mandated individual prayer rugs, and six feet separation. Keeping the social distancing and measuring the temperature and taking everybody's name, uh, you know, who is attending, just because this can happen anywhere. Aziz says most all mosques have been cooperating with these guidelines. Overwhelming majority of the mosques, 95 to 98 percent of the mosques, remain closed since the beginning of March. The latest positive case is just the latest reminder we are still in a pandemic. In Dallas, I'm Jordan Panik.